Hey everyone. So, I'm actually on my way to the doctor right now. Which, I guess in and of itself is not that eventful. Until I get to the, the, the meat of it. So, actually yesterday... You know what, look, I tell the story, no shame, stuff happens. So, went to car dealership, getting some stuff out of my car, and you know how inside your car there, how it's terraced right there, so you've got the, that terraced area where it kind of goes like that. So, I really had my knee resting kind of in between that, close to the latch. And so, I'm pulling this uh, booster seat out of the car, and but it felt like that part of the car was kind of digging into my knee right there on the the lateral side of my left um leg and i was like ah let me move i don't really like the way that feels so when i go to move back now granted all i'm doing is coming back so i'm not twisting or doing anything like that like i hear like a sound like sounds like i don't know if you can hear that but that's what it sounded like hopefully that showed up but the sound you might make me you crack your knuckles or something like that and then <clears throat> my knee like it kind of like locked up for a second so i couldn't i was like oh oh you know what i'm saying so i said all right maybe you know i'm getting a little older body parts do make strange sounds from time to time but I haven't had any pain or anything, so I shouldn't have anything to worry about. So, when I go to turn around, well, not, no, let me, let me back up. In the story, not literally. But when I go to start to walk back to my car, I take that first step, and I just feel pain right across the upper uh, left portion of my knee kind of right there ordering my kneecap I'm like what the world is going on here so I'm trying to walk and I'm like oh man this is really this is hurting so I end up hobbling back to my car so fast forward today try to go to work he had to be there at 3 o'clock in the morning and I'm hobbling around of course and by about 8.30 ish 9 ish I feel like this is getting worse. Um, so I knew I was probably going to call uh, an orthopedic specialist to get it, see if I can get it looked at because, granted, this is the same knee that I had the surgery on. And so for the 10 or 11 of you who saw that video, um, I'll put a link for, for in the bottom for those of you who haven't. Well, I talked about that and kind of took you through my before and after that day. But I said all that to say, yeah, it kind of feels like the same thing might be happening, but I don't know, maybe in a different part of the knee, like that pain feels real similar. So, I'm going to go in here and see what they say. Um, so, I don't know, I might be on the show for a little bit, but we'll see what happens when I get there. So, I decided I'm going to take you all on this journey with me, and we will see what happens. just x-rayed me just talked to the tech so the I guess PA or whoever will be in here in a bit to talk with me and look me over and kind of see what we need to do from there so I'm back at home so apparently what happened was a, I'm gonna see if I can use the technical term here, a, I don't know if it 
it's on here. Hopefully, maybe. Do they have it on here what it was? I'm going to try to say it, but I'm probably going to butcher it. But it was a patella femoral subluxation, which is basically a fancy way of saying I had a partial dislocation of my kneecap. Which that's, If it sounds like it was painful just saying it, imagine how it is experiencing it. So I will be on the shelf for a little bit. So I guess it'll be a little, uh, a little, of course, let down on videos. But actually, there's some that I recorded recently. I just haven't uploaded it yet. So I guess this will just give me time to upload those and get caught up. So I just wanted to update that. Oh, oh, before I forget. So I got this. Uh, hopefully you can see it. This little gift bag here i don't even know what's in it so it looks like i'm reaching in here the door just closed how about that it's really windy out here uh it is a uh coffee mug a clear coffee mug and then a letter but it's got my government on it and i'm not gonna disclose that so um i'm sorry so i will be back with a video soon but i did just want to take you all on that journey let you know how it went and everything that i don't have to have surgery so that's a good thing um but i do have to go back next week and uh we'll see how we are next week after um the anti-inflammatories and then if the shot that they actually gave me how we progress from there so i will be back soon with some more videos and more content for the 20 or so of you who watch, I do appreciate it, by the way. But I'll be back real soon. Peace.